Biker TV is brought to you by Parts Canada and Drag Specialties. We support the sport. CTV, CHCH, CTV2, the new BTV. Herb Group Job Fair, employer of choice. Find out why. Welcome to Biker TV. By bikers, for bikers. This week on Biker TV, we're hanging with the Canadian Pickers, checking out the Captain America bike. The second annual VON Poker Run. More Flat Track Canada. But first, more of the 10th annual Wharf Rat Rally. Daddy, what is God? This week on Biker TV, we're in beautiful Digby, Nova Scotia for the Wharf Rat Rally 10. Food's great, people's fantastic, and a real good time. Doing a great job raising money. We're over 42,000 raising money, and our share, of course, goes to the kids for the Shriners. Oh my god, we've been around for 16 and a half years now, uh, working six days a week. We're uh, halfway between Montreal and Ottawa, a little bit closer to Ottawa than Montreal. What's new? Anything and everything. Anything that you can draw on a napkin uh, can be done. Uh, whether it's sheet metal, motors, transmissions, fiberglass, we'll do anything. We run up four of our bikes to show the uh, nice folks in Digby what we do down near Montreal. Uh, we got a Rogue Glide right here, 2011, all decked out. We've got a bobber with a supercharger on it. Crazy ride. We got another little bobber there, a nice lime green job. And we got a long pro street over there with a 300. Is there like a certain style that you guys have or it looks here like it's a mix mash of just about anything? Everybody is different, so all the bikes should be different. Yep. Nothing should be redone twice. This here is a tattoo he has on his shoulder. So we built the bike around his tattoo. Okay. So I see there, this one here got first place here at Warfry yeah. Rally. We're very happy about that. Yeah. I got to show you the boxes. Yeah, let's see the box. Can you introduce yourself? Can you say your name? Ryan. And, and who's your dad? Sean. And who's, who's, what's dad's company's name? Sean's Customs? Yeah, yeah. Sean Sean's Dog's Customs. So you guys have been coming to Digby for how long? This is our fourth year. Okay. Yeah. So what keeps you coming back? Uh, just the, the people, uh, the atmosphere, everything, like uh, the food. Uh, we get to see friends that we don't get to see for a year, and then we come back here every like year us? and we get to see, yeah, exactly. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Is Warfare Rally really good for business? It definitely is, yeah. It uh, kind of, you know, makes ends meet people. You get to meet new people, uh, kind of. They get to see your product and everything. People yeah. that didn't know about you know about you now and stuff like that. So it's good, yeah. So the people who don't know you, like, is there a certain style that you do? I don't know. I just do what I do. I, I like what I do and just going to be honest to myself and I'm just going to do what I like to do. So what are you riding? Uh, it's a 07 Softail Deluxe, 
Uh, it's been tricked over a little bit. Lots of extra chrome, apes, uh, illuminated floorboards and mirrors, and a custom seat by Harley. It's not too bad. Nice soft deal. So what do you think of the Warfare Rally? It's great. A lot more bikes than last year. Yeah? Yeah, it was uh, busy, a lot busier here by, say, 11 o'clock yesterday. So it's a really good turnout this year. It's really enjoyable. Having a great time. What do you think of the apes? I love them. They're yeah. way more comfortable. Do they they're, give you a hard time in other provinces? No, they're not too bad. They're about a 17, but they slope down to a 15, so it's not yeah. that bad. They do pretty good. Quebec's bad. Black is the new chrome here. Oh, yeah, I'd say yeah. it's beautiful. Yeah, we like it. How long did it take you to do that? Oh, it all came in different stages. Whenever he'd have something fabricated or whatever, right, he'd get it over to me. And... Yeah. Can you introduce yourself, just for people uh, who don't know you, Donnie? Yeah, OK. Donnie Dory from Dragon Powder Coating in St. John, New Brunswick. Been here nine years now. Another good year to this year. Yeah. yeah. So you and Paul team up there? Yeah, he's kind of one of my best customers, you might say. I, yeah. <laughs> I get to do a lot of his stuff, right? That's awesome. Yeah. But he demands it. Yeah. Well, I've seen your work yeah. in a lot of places. Yeah. Book early. <laughs> That's book the main thing. Now. Book early. If you're coming down, book it now. After the break, we're hanging with the Canadian Pickers, checking out the Captain America bike. We take people that want to get into the industry and we spend 15 weeks with them and we prepare them to work in, a, in an authorized Harley-Davidson dealership as a technician. Harley-Davidson training. The sky's the limit. Spady Transport. Now hiring owner-operators. Join today and work for the very best. Now hiring owner-operators. Spady Transport. Dragon Jeans, what Biker TV rides in. Protect your assets. Dragon Jeans. Enjoy the ride. We'll take care of the rest. Challenger Motor Freight. Now hiring owner operators, drivers, apprentices, and licensed mechanics. Challenger Motor Freight. Our people, our strength, our future. Welding Techniques, training for success. Come see our new virtual training lab at advancedwelding.ca. Tilbury Auto Sales RV Omaha. One-stop shop, over 300 units in stock. RVs, power sports, autos, Yamaha. Financing for everyone. TilburyAutoSales.com. Biker TV is brought to you by be on Biker TV at Motorcycle and Power Sport Atlantic. Kent County Customs, expert service and cool customs. CPN, custom engraving and powder coating. Congrats on the new location, Custom Creations, Cycle and Ink, Cambridge, Nova Scotia. Lucas Oil Motorcycle Products, made in America, sold to the world. Conquer Motorcycles. Conquer your ride. Custom Rides and Rods, a must stop in Kelowna, BC. Conquer Motorcycles. 
closed captioning by the Ryan Villapoto Bike Charity Auction. Support Radio for Radiation. Canadian Pickers were here and Scott liked one of my bikes, Captain America, and decided that he should have one and I suggested that I might build one for him. He agreed and commissioned me to build him a bike. So we're building him a, a Captain America. We couldn't find a presentable pan head to start on so I mentioned that we should use a shovel head engine with an electric start and not so long a front end and a front brake and a disc brake on the back. He agreed and we just got started. We just got back now and carried the frame in. We're about to start any time now. We got the transmission on its way here in the motor. The motor's all polished. The engine cases are shiny as hell. The transmission's all polished, all rebuilt. It's got Andrew's gears in it. Motor's got a cam, big valves, high compression pistons. Uh, I gotta go like snot. My name's Scott Cousins. Some people know me better as one of the pickers on the TV show Canadian Pickers. I just wanted to show you my bike, the bike that Ed Leslie built for me. On the show, I asked him if he would build me a replica, sort of, of the Easy Rider chopper that Peter Fonda had. And Ed built it for me, presented it to me at Havelock during the festival last year, and here it is. Ed had a Harley Davidson shop in the 60s in Toronto, I believe. Ed is one of the nicest guys you'll ever meet, and he's the best bike builders. I've seen all of the bikes he's built at his place, and they are fabulous. So when he said he would build this for me, I knew that I had the best bike builder in Canada building the bike for me. It's slightly different than the original, which nobody knows where the original is, but it, the original had a pan head in it. Uh, this one's got a shovel in it. He put a front brake on it because the original didn't have a front brake, but I wanted to have a bike that I could ride that was legal, so he put a front brake on it for me. He also cheated, and he gave me an electric start on it as well, even though I still have the kick start, but I, I said, you know what? I'd like to have the electric start because I remember my brother had a bike like this and got thrown over the front handlebars one time trying to start it. The other difference between this one and the Easy Rider bike is this one has got a lot more chrome because if you watch the movie it doesn't have anywhere near as much chrome as this one. It chromed pretty much every piece on this bike that isn't painted or leather. I was lucky enough, or unlucky as my mom would say, to have a big brother that liked motorcycles. So I used to always sneak rides on his motorcycles when, when I was a kid. And he actually had an XLCH 1000 that he fully chopped and drove to Texas and back, back in the 70s. So I got my love of motorcycles from him. I drove a lot of dirt bikes and then I, I worked my way up until I got myself a Harley and I've been riding a Harley ever since. But I always wanted a chopper. I always wanted this chopper because I remember my brother had the pictures of Peter Fonda and Dennis Hopper with the poster on his wall. And I used to listen to the Easy Rider soundtrack all the time. So this, is, this to me is an icon of the generation I grew up in. After the break, more Flat Track Canada. Biker TV is brought to you by Universal Cycle. We don't just sell motorcycles, we sell motorcycling. The CMDRA, drag racing action. Kane's Harley Davidson, complete sales and service. Lucas Oil Motorcycle Products, made in America, sold to the world. Lucid Customs Motorcycle Garage, complete motorcycle service, sales and customs.
Laidlaw Carriers Tank Sudbury Office is now hiring quality owner operators. Company drivers also wanted four days on, four days off option. Our people and our equipment set us apart. RPM Havelock, the show that has it all. Every type of cool car, all the car clubs, artistry and iron motorcycles. Who has Canada's coolest big rig? The Trucker Television Show and Shine. Swap meet, farm equipment, boats, world class plowing match. RPM Havelock, the show that has it all. 12 gauge customs, award winning trucks, big rig chrome and accessories. Shop online or call. 12 gauge customs. Biker TV is brought to you by Hip Cycle, where Biker TV goes. Creative Chaos Tattoo, not for the weak of heart. Biketoberfest 2015, live to ride. Flat Track Canada. Lucas Oil Motorcycle Products, made in America, sold to the world. Atlantic Canada's largest motorcycle rally, the Wharf Rat Rally, Digby, Nova Scotia. Not all V-Twins are the same, but it only takes one oil brand to keep them running smooth and strong. Lucas, no matter the size, shape, attitude, or how you ride it, Lucas Motor Oils are specially blended with Lucas technology to improve performance and life of your V-Twin. At Lucas, what you put in your V-Twin keeps what you put on it moving forward. Lucas Oil, available at quality motorcycle retailers. track it's um, a track that we used to race on about 10 years ago and it just came back on the series last year I won it last year and uh, so far today is going great uh, I just won my 450 expert main event and uh, I won my heat race and we're getting ready for the open expert main event my father raced flat track for a long time ever since I was born I've been around a flat track so I just kind of was bored into it. It's kind of in my blood, I guess. Uh, for me, it's all about the speed and being sideways and everything. There's just nothing better than it. Another day, another race, you know. People travel from everywhere, from the States, you know, all over Ontario and come back to be here today. And uh, they just can't wait to see their second family. KTM 450. That's the one we rode in the production frame class. Basically, it's a, a motocross bike converted for dirt track. We got 19 inch wheels front and rear and lowered suspension. And uh, for the Open Expert race, I'm riding a 750 Harley. It's a V twin, specifically built for flat track racing. And uh, you know, it's a historical bike, and I love riding it. We go everywhere, like we go, not this year there's no races in Quebec, but in the past there's been races in Quebec and we've been down to Welland, we've been to Windsor, so we're in London. My husband Brad drives the number 666 in the VET class. This is our summer every weekend, 22 weekends. This bike has a, a story behind it as well. It was in the last Evil Knievel movie. 
There is three bikes. Uh, this one is a 1988 Rotex uh, 605, and um, it's got a woods frame, and that's probably about all I could tell you about the bike, but it was used in the movie, and uh, when we got it, it was painted with the red, white, and blue for Evil Can Evil, so. I ride these 450s from uh, KTM. Uh, Apex Cycle Sports, they really help me out a lot, getting these things all dialed in. Uh, John Parker, my, uh, my dad talks to him a lot to get a lot of information, and then of course, I, I gotta thank my dad a lot for, he gets these things dialed in everywhere we go, spends hours in the garage getting these 450s ready to go. What I like about Flat Track Canada is it has different races. Like we were going to Welland pretty much every weekend for CMA and there's one or two other races. We try to, you know, like encourage people to wear proper gear and things like that when we can. But for the most part, I mean, it's up to the riders to, to make sure that they're safe when they're racing. Um, we basically just try and help after the fact if there is an issue. Um, most of the time they don't want to see us because it's either a bad omen or things like that, right? There's one thing everyone said at the racetrack and it's that uh, families that race together are families that stay together. After the break, the second annual VON Poker Run. Dragon Jeans, the authentic motorcycle jeans. Biker TV rides safe in Dragon Jeans. Dragon Jeans, what's covering your butt? The Bikers Reunion. Bikers battling cancer. New Liskert, Ontario. Canada's biggest ride, the Freedom Ride. 15 miles of motorcycles. We want you. The Bikers Reunion. Ontario Truck Driving School. Your path to success. Training for your future. Thousands of jobs. Ontario Truck Driving School. Biker TV is brought to you by Conquer Motorcycles. The Cumberland Motorcycle Roundup, BC's biggest biker bash. Freak Show Choppers, everything cool on two wheels. Lucas Oil Motorcycle Products, made in America, sold to the world. Steve Drain, Harley Davidson. Enjoy the ride, we'll take care of the rest. Challenger Motor Freight, now hiring owner operators, drivers, apprentices, and licensed mechanics. Challenger Motor Freight, our people, our strength, our future. On my way to seven national championships in the dirt, I always demanded the best of myself and my equipment. Still do today, out on the road with my buddies and our V-Twins. That's why I know we can count on Lucas High Performance Motorcycle Oil keep our V-Twins running in top form. The Lucas Oil in my bike, it runs cooler, smoother, and quieter. Hey, that's kind of like me. Whatever. You guys got a problem with that? Uh, 
proud sponsor of the Lucas Oil AMA Motocross Championship Series. Welcome back to Biker TV, simply the best in Canadian motorcycling. I'm here at Duke's Harley-Davidson in Chatham, Ontario, and we're gearing up for the second annual VON Poker Run. Let's get this show on the road. First of all, appreciate everybody for taking time to come out and do the poker run. Ladies and gentlemen, I can speak from a personal point of view. VON is an important part of our community, so it provides an excellent service. In 2004, my wife died of cancer. And during that time, the five weeks that she was home with me, we needed services in order to provide that quality of life that she needed, the services that were required for her. And I'll tell you, without VON, it would have been more difficult on me as an individual, and as we think we're tough, the situations in our life were not that tough to begin with. No matter what we may look like on the outside, the inside we all still have big hearts. So I want to thank you very much because the services in the ride today is about providing funding for a service that is important throughout our communities across Ontario, throughout Canada. And I think it's important that today raising the funds and the awareness of VON is so important. So on behalf of the community, I want to say thank you very much for taking the time we all wish the weather was like it was yesterday, but unfortunately it's not. So we'll just take what we get, because we're not fussy about the weather. It's about the importance about getting out and riding our bikes and enjoying the, the days that we have. Each day of our life is so important. I have never met so many giving, unbelievable people that give their time, it's just unbelievable. It's, it's just so shock. Important. Yes, so many yes, too. exactly. It helps everybody, everybody. So and people don't realize people at home that don't have problems with illness or elderly care or any of that. People don't really realize until they need those services. And VON will touch their lives in one way or another. They're there. Their their communities. The services are amazing. This morning it wasn't looking too good when I got here and I thought, uh-oh, but you know what? A great turnout and it just shows, I think, how much people care about the VON. It was great. I think they're pretty well known for what they do and pretty appreciated in the community. They are, absolutely. I know, uh, my, I had an experience with them with my parents before they passed away, so oh, yeah. they were a big help to them and our family too. Were you out on the, our first annual VON run last No, year? I wasn't. No, you no, missed it? I missed it. So I actually seen it on Biker TV and I was pretty touched, you know, so I just yeah, I decided to do it this year. Oh, right on. Yeah. So good to have you. Tell me about your bike. It's pretty, uh, pretty unique, pretty interesting. Yeah, it's a different looking uh, bike. Uh, it's uh, Dave Green built this bike back in 2011 and uh, I had the privilege to buy it off him and uh, I'm having a lot of fun with it, that's for sure. No kidding, you're looking good doing it too. It looks great going down the road. Thank you. That's, uh, I think that's the biggest front wheel I've ever seen in my life. That's a 26, it kicks ass. It is, eh? Yeah. <laughs> Good to see you. you nice too. to see you out riding. Your bike's real clean. I was gonna say you must have not got caught in the rut in the rain today. Oh yeah. Really? Like look at it. I know, but it's, uh, you're looking at the Chinese side. Yeah. <laughs> you got a, a girl that comes in detail. Oh, I wish. <laughs> I wish. Why? Well, yeah, yeah. No, I'm not I'm volunteering. Looking. I was gonna say if you have one, send her down my way. Yeah, I know. I <laughs> Mine's know. a mess.
how you been doing? Good. Good. Thanks for joining us on the ride today. Mm -hmm. Who are you riding with? My grandpa. What's your grandpa's name? Jeff. What's Jeff ride? Uh, fat boy. Pretty sweet fat boy too, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Nice. Nice. You go to Dukes all the time, don't you? Yeah. Is that who you're going to get your future fat boy from? Yep. That's what you're going to ride, eh, when you mm -hmm. grow up? Yeah. A little bit, a couple or years. Or a street glide. Or a street glide? Mm -hmm. Why do you like the street glide? Maybe because the road queen has one? Maybe. It's pretty sweet, isn't it? Mm-hmm. <laughs> I thought you'd like that. And you're riding behind me on the way to here, so it's noisy, isn't it? Mm-hmm. It's just blah. Oh, you like that? Mm hmm Loud pipes save lives, right? Mm -hmm. We all take pride in our rides. Send us a picture of your sweet bike and it might be on national TV. Two wheels, good enough for Biker TV. Like us on Facebook and check us out at bikertv.ca. We all take pride in our rides. Send us a picture of your sweet bike and it might be on national TV. Next week on Biker TV, more of the second annual VON Poker Run. The Cumberland Motorcycle Roundup, Vancouver Island's biggest biker bash. Artistry and Iron Motorcycles with Edjo. Biker TV is brought to you by Advanced Welding Techniques, training for success. BTV Advertising, transportation industry specialists, we speak to millions. Parts Canada and Drag Specialties, we support the sport.